Silmo finally got his bike in there, right? Tell me a little bit about what you know about this bike. Um, I just know it's genuinely big, man. Supplied with the Kawasaki engine and all the rest. I mean, it has had a full restoration recently. So you tell the guy told me they spent something like twenty-seven and a half grand. Yeah, about up to twenty-seven thousand pounds. But it was originally built in nineteen seventy-six, supplied to Hull Kawasaki. So it's a genuine Rickman. It's a genuine Rickman. Like the nickel frame, really obviously. All the nickel plates are frame. That everything is as. It, as it should be, but it has been completely restored, repolished, repainted, everything, but it's done to the highest standard. It's a fantastic uh, piece of show things, yeah. It is a fun. I mean, I do, I do love them. I don't know how much they, uh, how easy they would be to ride, but I do love them. It's like, for me, I like things like Spondon, yeah. uh, obviously, uh, Motor Martin CBX. I mean, I would love a Motor Martin CBX, but it would have to be something really special for me to sort of have it stood there and to, to be able to look at it. Yeah. So this is this is stunning. I, I, I think if anybody wanted to see this bike, we would have to, you know, physically see it because I don't think any pictures that we might put on the net would either give that. The it's as new into it. It's absolutely stunning. I mean, to everything, to every single little ball as you can see. Uh, Thank you for the fluids of the bike. It's well, just, it, you know, what I mean, it, it'd be testament to the man then who's done this because it'd be interesting to see how long it took him to do it. Yeah. I mean, uh, Rickman was just a bit before my time. I was, like you said, you like you. What do you mean a bit before your time? Well, it, when did this come out? 76. 76, I was obviously. So, so you would have been about 25 years then. Yeah, really. Yeah. <laughs> but I was always a big fan of Alice, Mark 1s and Mark 2s. Um, but now we've got this and people have commented. It's amazing how many people actually contacted us. Quite a few from the Rickman Club. Oh, really? Saying, yeah, what a special bit of kit. And actually giving us some background to it, which is really interesting and very well, helpful. So he tell me that the actual club, the Rickman Club, uh, they're, they're, they're really good, knowledgeable guys in there. And obviously, that, they're the type of people we want to be in touch with, don't we? They know about these bikes, they'll tell us all about it. So have they given you any indication about this bike? Yeah, they told me it, they were the original one. It, it got the right motor for the right frame and supplied us new to a Kawasaki dealer. Uh, really interesting. I mean, you get that with, with specialism. And specialist bikes that the, the clubs out there will contact you and they'd love to give you information what they know which is fantastic for us yeah. because we can't know like every bike that we take in and there's specialists out there but you just said to it is a well it's a great it's a great find and, and obviously you know if anybody does want to come down and, and see it we, we can uh, there's one two time we can't let anybody in but we certainly can go through the bike and maybe do a video for people i would like to try and add to that if i'm honest and that is to sort of get the likes of a a good quality motor Martin, you know, that yeah. type of stuff. Um, I mean, I, I just love that that sort of style and that look. And I think it's an absolutely fantastic bike and it's worthy of, of anybody's mantelpiece, really, isn't oh, it? Oh, definitely. Yeah, definitely. So I think if anybody out there has got likes of any motor Martin CDXs, Harris's, Spondas, anything like that, they'd be possibly looking at one to sell. Yeah. Um, contact us and, you know what I mean, we'd be really interested. Well, we've had a we've had a, a, a weird start, uh, obviously continuing on uh, from last year in terms of, of COVID and the way that things have gone. But what we have had is an excellent start in terms of bike sales and, and people inquiring about the classics. And I think you've been extremely busy over the last sort of uh, two or three months, haven't you? You know, selling and and, and, and sending videos and all sorts of things. Yeah, it does. Well, it's just. But we're, we're always looking for good stock and, and you can see this is a class stock uh, item and, and we'd like to get as many of this type of bike as we can. So if you've got something that's tucked away that you think is ready for uh, uh, departing with, please get in touch, we would uh, we would like to. And our telephone number, if you don't already know it, is uh, audible 142 or steelcityclassics.co.uk. Mark, thanks for that. It's a great bike and, and let's keep the momentum going. It's, uh, it's enthusiastic, it's, it's fun and we've got some fantastic customers that have come to us. It's been great. I totally agree, yeah. yeah. Good stuff. Perfect.